Welcome back to another episode with PixelMweb. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to uninstall QuickTime on your computer, on your Windows computer. Uh, the reason to do so is Apple officially announced that they will no longer be supporting the application uh, for Windows and there are two security vulnerabilities that have been uh, noted by Trend Micro in a recent blog post. Um, so the best course of action at this point in time is just to uninstall uh, the application. And the way to do that is uh, very simple. It's just like uninstalling any other application within your um, your computer. All you have to do is navigate to your control panel and then it'll pop up. And then you just go to uninstall programs and then it'll pop up this window. And then you're going to see it right there and you can just click on uninstall and then it's going to give you a prompt. Are you sure you want to uninstall QuickTime 7? Just click on yes. And then it'll go through the process of uninstalling the application. It might take some time, but um, it's definitely something you should do since uh, any security issues that might exist on your computer um, is a way for a potential hacker that has malicious intent uh, to try to access your computer uh, remotely or to uh, do something that you will not want to do. Um, so definitely uninstall it. Um, it's also recommended that if you're not using any specific um, applications, um, if you haven't used it in a, in a while, then you should probably uninstall it from your system as well. You want to minimize the applications you have installed on your system. Uh, so once it's uninstalled, um, you're good to go. Very simple to do. Just um, you know, run the uninstall uh, uninstaller from your control panel and then you are set. If you want a good alternative for the uh, QuickTime on Windows, you can just head over to uh, videoland.org and you can download the VLC uh, media player, uh, which is a good alternative um, to QuickTime itself. It's very easy to use and in another tutorial I'll go over uh, that process, but it's an open source platform. Um, and it's something that is compatible with virtually all your operating systems. As you see here, it's supported in Windows, OS 10, Linux, Android, and um, Apple iOS as well. Um, so just go over there and just download the VLC media player and you're good to go. As noted, delete uninstall QuickTime from your Windows computer. Uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for, uh, to the next episode. And if you liked this video, make sure you hit the like button and also don't forget to subscribe as I'll be giving you more uh, information and tutorials on how to secure your computer and how to you know create websites. So I look forward to seeing you next time. Take care.